Here's question six, have a go. So start off by replacing tan to x by being sine to x over cos to x. Remember sine over cos equals tan. Then um, go and bring the right hand side over to the left hand side. Multiply through by cos 2x gives us this. Factorize gives us this. And then really just writing it the other way around gives us what we had to show. Now for part B, we, we're asked to hence solve, solve this. Well, what we're going to solve is the equivalent. We're going to solve this, effectively this pair of brackets. So for this product to be naught, either the first bracket has to be naught or effectively the second bracket, sine 2x has to be naught. So we have two separate ways we can get a product of zero. So looking at the first one first of all, uh, adding 5 cos 2x to both sides we get this, divide through by 5 we get cos 2x being a fifth. So let capital X be 2x uh, and then um, uh, so cos x is a fifth so using our calculator we get our first solution of 78.5 now we need to, we need to adjust our boundaries remember uh, our limits so capital x boundaries are twice as big so they're going from 0 to 360 so looking at our all silver toy cars the other solution the only other solution we get where cos x is positive up to 360 is going all the way around to the fourth quadrant giving us 281.5 360 minus 78.5. So they're the two solutions coming from this. Now from sine 2x, best just to do this straight from the sine curve, we get the solutions of 0, 180 and 360. 360 counts because it's less than or equal to 360. So bringing all of these together, these are all our solutions for capital X. We want our solutions for little x, little x being half of capital X. So we halve all these solutions to get our set of solutions which are these in red.